Welcome to our exploration of the 10 biggest mysteries in modern physics. These are the questions that keep scientists up at night, pushing the boundaries of our understanding of the universe. From the invisible scaffolding of dark matter to the unseen hand driving the universe's expansion, we'll journey into the heart of these enigmas. We'll delve into the bizarre realm of quantum mechanics and grapple with the nature of time itself. Get ready to have your mind blown wide open. Let's begin. Imagine a cosmic ballet, galaxies swirling in a grand waltz. Now picture this, there's not enough visible matter to hold them together. They should be flying apart, but they're not. Why? Enter dark matter the elusive substance making up 85% of the universe's matter. We can't see it, touch it, or even detect it directly. Yet, its gravitational influence is undeniable, holding galaxies and galaxy clusters together like invisible glue. Scientists are building ever more sensitive detectors, hoping to catch a glimpse of this elusive quarry. Unraveling the mystery of dark matter could revolutionize our understanding of the universe. The universe is expanding, like a cosmic loaf of raisin bread rising in the oven. But here's the kicker. The expansion is speeding up, and no one knows why. This baffling observation implies the existence of a mysterious force pushing everything in the universe apart. Dark energy. It's like an anti-gravity, counteracting the pull of gravity and causing the universe's expansion to accelerate. Imagine a force so powerful that it overrides the collective gravity of all the stars, galaxies, and dark matter in the cosmos. Scientists estimate that dark energy makes up 68% of the universe's total energy density, yet its true nature remains one of the biggest enigmas in modern physics. Is dark energy a property of space itself, or is it something even weirder that we haven't even imagined? In the world of the very small, quantum mechanics reigns supreme, describing the bizarre behavior of particles at the atomic and subatomic levels. These particles don't follow the rules of classical physics. Instead, they exist in a state of probability, where their position and momentum can only be described in terms of likelihoods. This realm is governed by the principles of uncertainty and superposition, where particles can be in multiple states at once until observed. Scientists have spent decades trying to understand and harness these strange behaviors, leading to groundbreaking technologies like quantum computers and cryptography. In the realm of the very large, general relativity governs the interactions of massive objects, like stars and galaxies. This theory, proposed by Albert Einstein, describes how massive objects warp the fabric of space-time, creating the force we perceive as gravity. It has been confirmed by numerous experiments and observations, such as the bending of light around massive objects and the precise orbit of planets. General relativity has given us insights into the workings of black holes, the expansion of the universe, and the nature of time itself. These two pillars of modern physics, however, seem fundamentally incompatible. Quantum mechanics and general relativity each provide incredibly accurate descriptions of their respective domains. But when scientists try to apply both theories to phenomena like black holes or the Big Bang, the equations break down. This incompatibility has led to one of the greatest challenges in modern physics, finding a way to unify these two theories into a single, coherent framework. They're like two different languages trying to describe the same universe. Quantum mechanics speaks the language of probabilities and wave functions, while general relativity speaks the language of curved spacetime and geodesics. Bridging this gap requires a new way of thinking, a new mathematical language that can encompass both the smooth, continuous nature of space-time and the discrete, probabilistic nature of the quantum world. Quantum gravity is the ambitious quest to unify these two titans, to find a single theory that explains the universe from the smallest particles to the largest cosmic structures. This quest has led to various approaches, such as string theory, which posits that the fundamental building blocks of the universe are not particles, but tiny, vibrating strings. Another approach is loop quantum gravity, which attempts to quantize spacetime itself, breaking it down into discrete chunks. 
One of the biggest challenges lies in reconciling the smooth, continuous fabric of space-time in general relativity with the quantized, probabilistic nature of the quantum world. In general relativity, space-time is a smooth, four-dimensional fabric that can be bent and stretched by massive objects. In quantum mechanics, however, the world is fundamentally discrete, with particles existing in specific states and locations. Finding a way to merge these two views is like trying to create a seamless fabric out of both silk threads and Lego blocks. It's like trying to stitch together a tapestry using silk threads and Lego blocks. The smooth, continuous nature of the silk threads represents the fabric of space-time in general relativity, while the rigid, discrete nature of the Lego blocks represents the quantized world of quantum mechanics. The challenge is to find a way to weave these two very different materials into a single, coherent tapestry that accurately describes the universe at all scales. A successful theory of quantum gravity could unlock some of the universe's deepest secrets. It could provide answers to fundamental questions about the nature of space and time, the origins of the universe, and the ultimate fate of black holes. It could also lead to new technologies and insights that we can't even begin to imagine. The quest for quantum gravity is not just a scientific endeavor. It's a journey to understand the very fabric of reality itself. Chapter 4. The Nature of Time, an Illusion or a Fundamental Reality Time, the relentless river that carries us from the past, through the present, and into the future. But what is time, really? Is it an illusion, as some physicists suggest, or a fundamental aspect of reality? We experience time as linear, flowing in one direction. Yet Einstein's theory of relativity tells us that time is relative, that it can speed up or slow down depending on your motion and the strength of the gravitational field you're in. Imagine two identical clocks, one on Earth and one in orbit. Time actually moves slightly slower for the clock on Earth due to the planet's stronger gravitational pull. The nature of time remains one of the most profound and perplexing mysteries in physics and philosophy. Chapter 5. The Hierarchy Problem Why is gravity so weak? Of the four fundamental forces of nature, gravity, electromagnetism, the weak nuclear force, and the strong nuclear force, gravity is the weakest by far. These forces govern everything in the universe, from the smallest particles to the largest galaxies. Yet, gravity stands out as an anomaly due to its relative weakness. Think about it. A tiny refrigerator magnet can defy the gravitational pull of the entire Earth. This simple observation highlights the stark contrast between gravity and the other forces. This vast discrepancy in strength, known as the hierarchy problem, has puzzled physicists for decades. Why should gravity be so much weaker than the other forces? Numerous theories and hypotheses have emerged. Some scientists believe that the answer lies in the very fabric of space and time itself. One possible explanation is that our understanding of gravity is incomplete, and there are aspects of this force that we have yet to discover. Perhaps there are extra dimensions of space, beyond the three we experience, where gravity can leak into, diluting its strength in our three-dimensional world. Another possibility is that the Higgs boson, the particle responsible for giving other particles mass, plays a role in suppressing gravity's strength. Solving the hierarchy problem could revolutionize our understanding of the fundamental forces of nature. The quest to understand why gravity is so weak continues to drive scientific research and exploration. Throughout history, many great minds have pondered the mysteries of gravity. Yet the hierarchy problem remains an unsolved puzzle, a tantalizing enigma that beckons us to delve deeper. Recent discoveries, such as the detection of gravitational waves, have provided new insights into the nature of gravity. Some physicists believe that string theory, which posits that all particles are composed of tiny, vibrating strings, could offer a solution to the hierarchy problem. The search for a grand, unified theory one that can explain all fundamental forces within a single, coherent framework, is one of the most ambitious goals in physics. Understanding why gravity is so weak could also shed light on the early universe and the conditions that led to the formation of galaxies, stars, and planets. The quest to solve the hierarchy problem is a global effort. 
with scientists from around the world collaborating and sharing their findings. As we continue to explore the mysteries of gravity, we inspire the next generation of scientists and researchers. The question of why gravity is so weak remains one of the most profound mysteries in science. The journey continues, and the possibilities are endless. Chapter 6. Neutrino Masses – Ghosts of the Quantum World Neutrinos are like the ghosts of the particle world, flitting through the cosmos by the trillions each second. These elusive particles are incredibly abundant, yet they remain one of the most mysterious components of the universe. Despite their abundance, they are notoriously difficult to detect because they interact so weakly with other matter. These tiny, nearly massless particles interact so weakly with matter that they can pass through the entire Earth as if it were a wisp of smoke. Imagine a particle so elusive that it can travel through a light year of lead without being stopped. This is the enigmatic nature of neutrinos. For decades, neutrinos were thought to be completely massless, but recent experiments have revealed that they do indeed have a tiny amount of mass. This discovery has profound implications for our understanding of the universe. The realization that neutrinos have mass has opened up new avenues of research and has led scientists to reconsider many aspects of particle physics. But how much mass they possess and what mechanism gives them this mass remains a mystery. The exact mass of neutrinos is still unknown, and determining it is one of the biggest challenges in modern physics. Various theories have been proposed, but none have been definitively proven. Understanding neutrino masses is crucial for cosmology, as these elusive particles played a significant role in the early universe. Neutrinos were among the first particles to emerge after the Big Bang, and they influenced the formation and evolution of the cosmos. By studying neutrinos, scientists hope to gain insights into the conditions of the early universe and the processes that shaped it. They could hold clues to the origin of matter-antimatter asymmetry and the evolution of large-scale cosmic structures. The fact that our universe is made mostly of matter, with very little antimatter, is one of the great unsolved mysteries of physics. Neutrinos might be the key to understanding this asymmetry and the reasons behind the dominance of matter in the universe. The quest to pin down neutrino masses is a challenging one, requiring massive underground detectors shielded from cosmic rays and other sources of background noise. These detectors are often located deep underground or in remote locations to minimize interference. The Super Kamiokande in Japan, for example, is a giant tank filled with 50,000 tons of pure water buried 1,000 meters underground. Scientists use these detectors to capture the rare interactions of neutrinos with matter, hoping to unlock the secrets of these ghostly particles. The data collected from these experiments is meticulously analyzed, as even the smallest hint of a neutrino interaction can provide valuable information. Researchers spend countless hours sifting through data, looking for patterns and anomalies that could reveal new insights into the nature of neutrinos. One of the fascinating properties of neutrinos is their ability to oscillate or change types as they travel through space. This phenomenon, known as neutrino oscillation, was a groundbreaking discovery that earned the 2015 Nobel Prize in Physics. It provided the first direct evidence that neutrinos have mass and opened up new questions about their behavior and properties. Neutrinos occupy a unique place in the standard model of particle physics. They are the only particles that interact solely through the weak nuclear force and gravity, making them incredibly difficult to study. Despite these challenges, the study of neutrinos is crucial for advancing our understanding of the fundamental forces and particles that make up the universe. The quest to understand neutrinos is a global effort, with scientists from around the world collaborating on experiments and sharing data. These international collaborations are essential for making progress in this challenging field. By pooling resources and expertise, researchers hope to unravel the mysteries of neutrinos and their role in the cosmos. Looking ahead, future neutrino experiments promise to shed more light on these enigmatic particles. New detectors and technologies are being developed to improve our ability to detect and study neutrinos. These advancements will bring us closer to answering some of the most profound questions about the universe and our place in it.
As we continue to explore the ghosts of the quantum world, we are reminded of the vastness and complexity of the universe. Neutrinos, with their elusive nature and mysterious properties, are a testament to the wonders that still await discovery in the realm of particle physics. Chapter 7. The Quantum Measurement Problem When Does Reality Collapse? The quantum world is a realm of probabilities, where particles exist in a superposition of states, like a coin spinning in the air, both heads and tails at the same time. But when we measure a quantum system, it seems to collapse into a definite state, like the coin landing on either heads or tails. This seemingly instantaneous collapse of the wave function, known as the quantum measurement problem, lies at the heart of the debate about the interpretation of quantum mechanics. When does reality become real? Some physicists believe that consciousness plays a role in collapsing the wave function, while others argue that it's a purely physical process, independent of any observer. The quantum measurement problem challenges our very understanding of reality and the nature of observation. Chapter 8. Cosmic Inflation. A universe born in a flash. Imagine the universe in its infancy a tiny speck of unimaginable density and temperature. Then, in a fraction of a second, it expanded exponentially, growing faster than the speed of light. This period of rapid expansion, known as cosmic inflation, is thought to be responsible for the universe's large-scale structure and uniformity. Scientists are searching for direct evidence of inflation in the cosmic microwave background radiation, the faint afterglow of the Big Bang. Understanding cosmic inflation could provide crucial insights into the universe's earliest moments, its origins, and its ultimate fate. Chapter 9. Matter-Antimatter Asymmetry Why is there something rather than nothing? For every particle of matter, there exists an antiparticle with the same mass but opposite charge. When matter and antimatter meet, they annihilate each other in a burst of energy. Somehow, a tiny excess of matter survived the annihilation frenzy, giving rise to the stars, galaxies, planets, and ultimately, us. Scientists are searching for clues to this asymmetry in the behavior of particles and antiparticles, hoping to uncover a subtle difference that could explain why matter won out over antimatter in the early universe. Chapter 10. High Energy Cosmic Rays – Messengers from the Cosmic Abyss From the depths of space come high-energy cosmic rays, particles traveling at nearly the speed of light, carrying energies far greater than anything we can achieve in our most powerful particle accelerators. These cosmic bullets bombard Earth from all directions, but their origins remain shrouded in mystery. What cosmic engines could possibly accelerate particles to such extreme energies? Supernova remnants, active galactic nuclei powered by supermassive black holes, and gamma-ray bursts are all potential candidates. Studying high-energy cosmic rays provides a unique window into the most energetic processes in the universe. By unraveling their origins and acceleration mechanisms, we can gain a deeper understanding of the cosmos and its most extreme environments. These 10 mysteries represent just a glimpse into the vast unknown that still lies ahead in our exploration of the cosmos. From the invisible hand of dark matter to the ghostly whispers of neutrinos, the universe continues to surprise and challenge our understanding. Stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of physics with us. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the cosmos.